Top 10 Towns Offering Free Land in the United States while the federal government no longer offers free government land to homesteaders, several cities and towns across the United States have free land programs for residential and business purposes. You'll often find free land programs in the Midwest, but other options exist, such as in the Northeast and West. If you've tried to find affordable housing lately, you know finding a home or apartment that fits your budget can be challenging. But what if you were willing to relocate to a city or town, giving away free land in the form of residential lots or free land opportunities for those wanting to open a business and create jobs for the community. If you're the adventurous type looking for free land in a new place, read on to learn more about how to get free land in the United States, the requirements you'll need to meet to qualify, and everything else you need to know before you decide to relocate to build your new home or business. The Homestead Act of 1862 before we discuss the details of getting free land in the United States, let's examine the history of free land programs. Congress passed the Homestead Act of 1862 in an effort to develop the American West and encourage economic growth by offering settlers 160 acres of free government land in exchange for living, improving, and farming the free land for at least five years. After the five-year period ended, the initial filer was granted free and clear title to the property by paying a small registration fee. The Homestead Act remained in effect until 1976. Settlers who took advantage of the Homestead Act included immigrants, single women, formerly enslaved people, and farmers without land of their own. Nowadays, the federal government no longer offers free homesteading land. Still, cities and small towns around the country have adopted the basic idea of the Homestead Act to attract new residents and businesses, often to areas needing economic revitalization. What is the purpose of free land initiatives? While the days of the Wild West are long gone, the principle of free land programs remains essentially the same. Today's homesteading land programs aim to achieve much the same result as the Homestead Act, giving away free land to encourage businesses and people to relocate to areas needing revitalization. The primary objectives of free land programs include attracting new residents, promoting economic development, revitalizing rural areas, increasing local tax revenues, and fostering community growth, explains Denis Michalov, a real estate broker at Wilson Real Estate. By offering free land, municipalities aim to entice individuals or businesses to establish themselves in the area, bring economic activity, and contribute to the local community. How to Obtain Free Land Towns offering free land each have different requirements for acquiring the free lots. That said, there are some standard criteria applicants should expect to meet. You must fill out an application to get free land. You must prove you have funding for the project, such as a pre-approval letter from a lender. Building a home or business on the free land would be best. You must be able to pay for any assessments or taxes associated with the property. You must gain approval from the local council or town governments. Sometimes, you must meet specific income requirements to qualify for free land. According to Smykolov, common requirements include building a residence within a specific period, meeting certain construction standards, occupying the property as a primary residence, or starting a business. Reselling the land shortly after the acquisition is often restricted to prevent speculation and ensure the program's intended purpose is met. Specific rules and restrictions may apply and should be understood before participating. Where to obtain free land in the United States? Several cities and towns offer free land, or rather, affordable land when you may need to cover real estate costs, administrative fees, and other expenses required to acquire property yourself. The following are the cities and towns offering free land as of 2023-1. New York Buffalo, New York, has established the Urban Homestead Program for those who want free residential lots but want to avoid living in a rural setting. The free lots offered can be obtained in one of three ways, taking ownership of a vacant lot that is adjacent to a homeowner's primary residence acquiring a vacant lot to be used for new home construction, undertaking rehabilitation of an existing residential structure. There are several requirements you need to meet to qualify for each option under the free home site program, but they all share a few common conditions. The property must be optional for any public use. 
no qualified buyer should be attempting to purchase the property. The free lots within designated urban renewal areas are only eligible for the Urban Homestead Program at the sole discretion of the Office of Strategic Planning in Buffalo, New York. In the case of new construction, the home must be completed within 12 months. The repairs must be done in 18 months if you're rehabbing a house. In either case, the homesteader is required to occupy the premises for a minimum of 36 months. 2. Claremont, Minnesota If your family has a gross annual income of $129,000 or less, you can find free homestead land in the small town of Claremont, Minnesota. However, choosing your lot requires a $1,000 non-refundable administrative fee. This program is unique because Arden Home Services, in partnership with the City of Claremont and Three Rivers Community Action, will construct modular homes for income-based single-family housing. Each home will be 1,000 square feet with two bedrooms, one bath, and a two-car garage. The basement will have room to add two bedrooms and another bathroom. Approved applicants must apply for USDA Rural Development Low Interest Loans and complete homeownership classes and counseling through Three Rivers Community Action Programs. 3. Curtis, Nebraska The small town of Curtis, Nebraska has free land sites available for residential lots and commercial industrial purposes. If you construct a home meeting town approved specifications within a specific time, you can receive the lot for free. Those who are interested in expanding, relocating, or starting a business in Curtis can also take advantage of specific free land opportunities, free commercial industrial land sites, generous business startup funds, tax increment financing through a progressive city council, a quality labor pool in the area. Curtis is a little off the beaten path, about 300 miles from the nearest major city of Denver, but it has most of a larger city's necessary services. Other towns with additional dining, shopping, and recreational activities surround it. Curtis is also home to the Nebraska College of Technical Agriculture, a movie theater, and the Arrowhead Meadows Golf Course. 4. Elwood, Nebraska The Wheatfield edition of Elwood, Nebraska offers 110 by 115 foot free lots as part of its home ownership program for owner-occupied residential properties. Construction must begin within one year of the purchase date and be completed within two years. The lots are free, but a $500 deposit is required, which will be refunded once the home is completed. The Village of Elwood also offers a down payment assistance program for new construction. If the house is finished within the allotted time and all other requirements have been met, the village will pay the homeowner 10% of the home's construction cost, up to $25,000. Elwood offers a handful of services, including shopping and dining. It boasts a city park with a swimming pool and a disc golf course, among other activities. It also has a public library and hosts the famous Gosper County Fair every July. 5. Grafton, Illinois To give one example of a wildly successful free land program designed to entice new residents, the town of Grafton, Illinois, began offering residential lots for a deposit of $5,000 apiece. If you build a home on the lot within three years, the town will reimburse you $5,000, making the land totally free. Of course, you still need to pay property taxes and construction costs, as Michael Morrow, mayor of Grafton. But, he adds, it's a beautiful subdivision, a new grade school, new pickleball courts, and a lot of families with young kids. Unlike some small towns, Grafton has a lot to offer. Situated right by the Mississippi River with a quaint but thriving downtown area, it's also conveniently located less than an hour from St. Louis and about four hours from Chicago, Kansas City, and Indianapolis, giving residents some big city access to airports, hospitals, and more recreational and shopping alternatives. 6. Flagler, Colorado For people interested in setting up a business, Flagler, Colorado, is located about two hours east of Denver and has 480 acres of free land zoned for commercial use. Flagler's free land incentive encourages economic development in the small town and creates new jobs for the community. 
Potential business owners are encouraged to apply and provide the following information, a detailed business plan, including startup costs and a timeline for completion, three years of tax returns, financial records, and a credit application, the amount of land needed for the business once your initial application is approved. You will deposit $10 per acre to proceed with the rest of the application process. The community will then be invited to a public hearing and the town council will decide. Applicants should be aware that there is no infrastructure for utilities on the property, so the cost of on-site utilities will be the sole responsibility of whoever takes possession of the free land. These expenses should be included in your business plan, and you'll also need to provide proof of funding for the project. 7. Lincoln, Kansas one of the larger small towns that offer free land, Lincoln, Kansas, the county seat of Lincoln County, offers free land on ready-to-build lots for new residents or anyone looking to build a new home. Projects must have a footprint of 1,300 square feet for a single-story house or 900 square feet for two-story homes, and they must have a permanent foundation and a two-car garage to qualify for the free land program. Lincoln is located in north-central Kansas, two hours from Wichita, Still, the town has everything you need, including banks, a locally owned grocery store, a pharmacy, a shopping center, and a movie theater, among many other essential services. 8. Manila, Iowa The Manila Economic Development Corporation, in cooperation with the City of Manila Municipal Utilities, is in the second phase of its free lot program, with 16 additional residential lots for single-family homes. The homestead land is part of the Sunrise Edition housing development and offers multiple perks for those looking to receive free land, excellent lot size, and location paved streets. On-site utilities with no hookup fees. Five-year property tax abatements. Although the town population is under 800 people, this small town has all the essentials and plenty of recreational options, including a semi-private nine-hole golf course. It also has easy access to large cities, such as Omaha, Nebraska, close to an hour away, and Des Moines, Iowa, about a two-hour drive away. 9. Plainville, Kansas The city of Plainville, Kansas, and Rooks County of Northwestern Kansas offers free land for residential construction. However, you'll need to move quickly with your plans to take advantage of the program. Construction of a permanent home must be completed within 18 months after you take possession of the free land. A $500 deposit is required but will be refunded at closing, assuming the buyer has completed all contract terms. Buyers will also be responsible for bringing all utilities to the house, but the good news is that the infrastructure is already in place. As a bonus to the free lots, the Rooks County Neighborhood Revitalization Plan allows for a rebate of property taxes on a sliding scale over 10 years. Plainville is far from the nearest large city. Wichita is about 200 miles away, but it has significant amenities. The town of Hayes is also only 30 miles away, with even more services, dining, and shopping options. 10. New Richland, Minnesota located about an hour and a half from the Twin Cities, New Richland, Minnesota, offers free lots to those who can build their homes within 12 months. While the land is entirely free, you will be responsible for some amenities, including water, sewage, and street access, which will be collected with your property taxes on a semi-annual basis over a 15-year period. Before you can begin the application process and acquire land, you'll need to produce a pre-approval letter from a lender proving your ability to obtain funding for the project. According to the City of Richland website, some lenders will allow you to use the free land as equity for a down payment on a construction loan. What to consider before you apply for free land? The idea of free or cheap land can be a powerful pull if you're struggling to find affordable housing and looking to relocate. However, there are a few factors you should consider before packing up your moving van, job opportunities, you may be a freelancer or remote worker who can work from anywhere. If you're not, however, consider that many of the towns listed above are located in a rural region or are farming communities, so they'll likely have fewer job opportunities for new residents. Building costs, even if you can find free land, you'll still need to cover the costs of building your new home or business on that land. 
That's why it's essential to make sure you can secure the necessary funding before you apply for a free land program. Taxes. Property taxes tend to be less expensive in areas offering free land, and some homestead programs provide tax incentives for new residents, but you should still be aware of the estimated taxes before you commit. Pro tip. It's crucial to thoroughly research each free land program's terms, conditions, and obligations. Local authorities, economic development agencies, or real estate experts can provide valuable information and guidance. Do states offer free land? States don't offer free land for homes or businesses. Instead, local governments of towns or cities create free land programs. You're more likely to find homesteading land in certain states, such as Kansas, Nebraska, and Minnesota. Is there unowned land in the U.S.? With so much property across the country going and used, you might wonder if no one owns some of it. However, there is no longer any land in the United States that is unowned, simply uninhabited. Some of it is public land owned by a local or federal government, while the rest is private property that isn't in use. Key Takeaways There are multiple opportunities to acquire plots of free land in the United States, most of which are offered in Midwestern states. You're most likely to find free land in rural communities that are attempting to entice new residents and businesses to increase the tax base and create new jobs. While land is often technically free, other costs, such as administrative fees or property taxes, may be associated with owning it. Before applying for free land, it's essential to understand the rules of each program, such as construction regulations, timelines, and occupancy requirements. Okay, that's today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and got some information out of it. Now go out, have a great day, and be nice to each other.